Um, I'm a teacher, so I'm sort of interested in some of the children's books and children's literature, and I enjoy reading myself, so I wanted to come check it out. Um, so this morning I saw Robert Caro, um, who wrote the um, popular, famous LBJ biographies, who was really interesting. Um, I also stopped by um, uh, Lois Lowry, because um, I loved Number the Stars as a child, and she was great also. My name is Ira Silverberg. I'm the literature director at the National Endowment for the Arts, and we're one of the funders of the festival and helped to arrange all the writers that came into this tent today, and we'll be here tomorrow. Because this is like tens of thousands of people coming out and celebrating books. It's not just good for DC, it's good for the whole region, it's good for the world, it's good for everyone who reads. I came here today because I heard that one of my favorite authors was going to be here, so I was really excited about that. Um, and I've been before, so I knew it was going to be a lot of fun. Uh, his name is Jeffrey Eugenides, and I'm actually in line right now to get my book signed. Um, and I've read, he has three books that I've read, um, The Marriage Pot, uh, Middlesex, and The Virgin Suicides, um, and they're just really great books. Good for DC because it gets people excited in reading. Um, I came when I was in middle school, um, the first time I came, so I was a little bit younger, but I was really excited about coming. People should buy a lot of books because it's good for the whole literary ecosystem. Writers need to eat, booksellers need to eat, publishers need to stay alive. It supports a lot of people. It's a big feature. Of the four females in the bar, three were engaged in self grooming running their hands through their hair to indicate their readiness for copulation. The males responded by lowering their voice.